Hi, this is Jennifer Evans with Create Often. I want to share with you a fun way to use Heidi Swap's art screens with temporary tattoo ink. Um, she has several different art screens, as you can see here, available um, exclusively at Michael's at this time. And you can see that there's different sayings in her handwriting and there's fun patterns. There's even some images. And um, I like to use the small art screen for this particular project, but you can also use um, the large art screens that ha are also come in large kits, which I'll, I'm going to show you how you in this video how to use both um, on one design. It's fun for parties and other um, activities and it washes off in about a week and a half. Um, there's this tattoo paint it's from Tattoo Junkie and you can find it at Walmart in the um, cosmetic section. There are three colors and I'm showing two here. There's a black henna and then a red. There's some um, large art screens that Heidi has that come with uh, two art screen inks, um, some caution washi tape. There's also um, large art screens that you can use. In this particular set that I'm using, um, there's this forever and ever. And then there's two here, uh, love this and just uh, uh, one that says love. And then this beautiful floral, which matches the, the small art screen that I love as well that I showed earlier in the floral pattern. To do this project, you just want to pull it from the, uh, the backing and just place it the art screen on your arm where you want to apply the tattoo. Um, this has a sticky back to it so you can reposition it and then um, lay it flat. So once you have the screen on in the place that you want it to go, um, you're going to want to apply the, um, the tattoo paint um, on the outside of the screen. And since the f I'm only going to be doing this one part of the screen because I wanted to show you how you can actually um, only do one area at a time and you don't have to do the full huge screen for this project. You can just do some, uh, maybe one word or one flower as I'm doing here. And you're going to want to apply it um, close to the edges and then take the brush that comes with the tattoo um, paint and, and brush it on. And I'm being careful here because I don't want to get the other petals and the other the other flower. Um, this flower is, you could see more of the detail, and I thought that that was kind of cool. Um, you'll see more paint than um, outline on this one. We'll just spread it around. And when you go ahead and um, pull it up, if there's areas that you've actually missed and you need to to clean it off. Th this is the time to do it. You can use it, a, a baby wipe and just wipe the edges so that it'll come right off. So you want to let that dry before you go and add another screen or move your screen around and, act, and lay it on your arm. And you don't want the paint to come up with your screen. So I just let it dry a little bit before I'm adding. This is one of the small screens that I showed earlier. And as you can see, I've used it several times with this ink. So it has a little bit of that black. Um, a good tip to, to note is when you're done with the screen and you take it off, you want to wash it off immediately. I didn't show that on this tape to save time, but you're just going to lay it on a nonstick craft surface and wipe it with a baby wipe on both sides, get the, the paint completely out of the screen, and then you'll lay it sticky side up to dry. And once it dries, it's sticky again, and so that you can store it and save it for next time because you can reuse these screens over and over. You can see that this paint dries really quickly and some parts can easily um, get missed. So you just wanna work at it and if it needs a little bit more work, you just lay that right back down, screen back down, and get those areas with the brush before it completely dries. Once you're done with your tattoo and you like the way it looks, there's this powder that comes in the pack 
and you'll want to um, either use a brush or your fingers to apply the powder to the tattoo to set it. And you could just read the um, package directions on how to use that. Well, this was so much fun. I hope that it encourages you to try something new with Heidi Swap's art screens. Until next time, create often.